now this is a subjective solved example 12th we have to find domain of this for x belongs to 0 to 2 pi find domain of this now domain means that we cannot have negative number inside the square root right we cannot have negative number inside the square root for y to be defined it means this quantity inside the square root should be non negative should be greater than or equal to 0 greater than or equal to 0 means this should be greater than or equal to 0 means sin inverse mod of sin x is greater than cos inverse cos x so we'll do it graphically we'll solve this inequality graphically we'll draw a graph of this right so y equal to cos inverse cos x and we draw a graph of y equal to sin inverse mod sin x this is like uh, it's very uh, see you have not done inverse function so uh, it is difficult to understand how to get the graph of this but you learn this graph as a graph of a basic function you don't have to worry how to get graph of this you remember the graph like this it's a periodic function with period 2 pi between 0 and 2 pi this is the graph x line 2 pi minus x straight line and this is pi and it it, you, you, it, it is it's a periodic function with period 2 pi means for other intervals you just have to repeat this left as well as right now this one this one for this one we need to remember we need to know the graph of sine inverse sine x sine inverse sine x sine inverse of sine x and the graph is like this again it's it is a periodic function with period 2 pi y equal to x till pi by 2 and then pi minus x till 3 pi by 2 and then x minus 2 pi straight lines all three are straight lines right sine inverse sine x but here we have sine inverse mod sine x that we can write as equal to sine inverse sine x if sine x is greater than 0 if sine x is positive we can remove mod sine if sine x is negative it is sine inverse minus sine x where sine x is less than 0 right and and you know you should you can again remember this sine inverse of minus x is minus sine inverse x minus we can take out from inverse so basically we can draw graph of this using graph of sine inverse sine x if sine x is greater than or equal to 0 minus of sine inverse sine x where sine x is less than 0 so now we know where, where sine x is positive and where sine x is negative this is the graph of sine sine is positive between 0 and pi you can see graph is above x axis sine x is positive sine x is greater than 0 and sine x is less than 0 in the interval pi to 2 pi so it means in interval pi to 2 pi to 0 to pi where sine x is positive in 0 to pi sine x is positive means we have this case we have to draw a graph of sine inverse sine x it means we have to draw this triangle using the graph of sine inverse sine x between 0 and pi we have to take this graph now between pi to 2 pi sin x is negative sin x negative means we have to use this definition minus of sin inverse x so using transformation and you know minus so you know to draw a graph of minus sin inverse sin x basically minus we can shift here it is like we we have to take image of sin inverse sin x in x axis because you replace y by minus y so take image in x axis so if you take image of this graph in x axis it is like this so it is minus sin inverse sin x image in x axis so between pi to 2 pi we have to draw this graph image so this is the graph of sin inverse mod sin x right using uh, this break break up function now if you draw on the same both of them on the same scale this is cos inverse is like this this is pi cos inverse is sorry this is pi by 2 if you draw cos inverse on the same scale
see this will overlap because in cos also the equation of this line is x in cos inverse cos cos inverse cos x it is x in sin inverse sin x it is x same here so both of them will merge this as well as this because definitions are same this is 2 pi minus x and in this case also it is 2 pi minus x so we have to find those values of x where you again we come back here we have to find those values of x where the sin inverse mod sin x graph is above greater than means above so this graph should be above the graph of cos inverse cos x so we have we have drawn graph of this we have drawn graph of this and we have to compare graphs where graph of this is above as well as equal to greater than equal to the graph of this above as well as where it meets the graph so we have to include this part where because two graphs are meeting and sine graph is not above the graph of cos cos is above sine sine is not above cos so we just have to take this part where the two are equal so answer is x belongs to 0 0 2 pi by 2 because in this part they are equal union 3 pi by 2 to 2 pi again this is the part when sine inverse mod sine x is equal to cos inverse cos x and we we'll other interval which we have to look for is where sine inverse sine x means this black graph is above blue red graph black above red nowhere they meet black and red meeting in this part and this part but black is nowhere above red red is above in fact red is above black so we we, we get this is the solution set